Inside Lavini's Pavilion, where a red-hot Harvard Crimson team hosts the Cornell Big Red, coming off their first win in five games yesterday. Top scorer in the Ivy League, a guy who, if he is hot, can fill it up, and that's a strong start. Gettings in trouble, toward his shoot. Robert Hatter slashes in, got it, plus the foul. Ball bobbled, Justin Bassey forces the turnover. Two on one, up top for an awesome one. Turns it over. It's turnover number seven. Chambers finds a trailing Bassey. Chambers runs down a rebound. He's going full tilt again. Chambers, circus shot. No, look out. Zeta and Ozimwan. They'll still in the thick of the playoff race. They'll still be in it even if they can't come back from down 19 tonight. A little bit of a mismatch with that Ozimwan guarding him. Morgan takes him to the rack and takes advantage. Morgan beneath the 10, and Osimwan got a piece, and Morgan still scored. Yeah. Gettings, no. Offensive rebound is ripped away by Desmond Fleming, and another effort goes through for Jack Gordon. Now, but Aiken's got no problem. Another Cornell turnover, the 12th of the game for the Big Red. Chambers to the rack for two. Played Harvard a lot more tough up to Cornell than they did here. Oh, look at the rejection from Seth Towns. Good case what? to be a, an 11 or a 12 seed. Spinning in, Bathurst, wow, that was pretty. Easy, good press by Cornell, but they finally do break it. Oh, Aiken, a fake to freeze, and then the finish. You said it, never got the single digit two. Seven to shoot, Aiken driving dish, here's a cutting town, he scores, plus the foul, an exclamation point for the Harvard freshman. Harvard has won four in a row, the Crimson is staying second place in the Ivy League, moved to eight and two in the conference, and 16 and seven overall. Harvard beats Cornell, 87-70. Five.